Folks, I think it's time to face down the big, bad, blue bird. Yes, uh, we're kind of taking a detour from last week because I'm a big dum-dum and kind of forgot that we need to wait for the seaweeds to, you know, grow. So, that's a thing. But what's also a thing is the shoal that's right bloody nearby. Now, unfortunately, it didn't spawn there. Wouldn't that have been something? That would have been bloody great if it actually spawned there. Uh, so, that means we have two options. Either sail around the world, just on a whim, hoping that I find the thing, or I go to that shoal, and I do myself a little bit of fishing, folks. Hmm. That's probably the better option. Oh, and I think we're gonna have some fun with it too, everyone. Ah, oh, do you shoot you? Remember how I said I was gonna weaponize my boat? Oh, this is like the perfect time to do it. Perfect time. Also, this boss loves running away from us, right? Right. We're gonna be four days away from winter. We know what that means. That means we get snowbirds. Hmm. This might be a great opportunity to use those crap ton of hound teeth that I have over by the trap area, folks. Yeah, I think we're gonna range this thing to death. And this also gives me great opportunity- Oh, It also gives me great opportunity to, uh, show off some of the stuff we've been doing lately, and, of course, some of the West rework stuff, I think. Because we got some time to waste, don't we? Yes, indeed we do. Okay. Um, hmm. Oh, well, I guess I could- Waste some time putting this on the boat. Yeah, we're going to be doing some stuff in between, folks, just to pass the time, pretty much. Until winter gets here, we'll farm some azure feathers, we'll make the darts, and then, hopefully, spawn the thing. Whew, that's good, everyone. I actually thought I wasn't going to have enough space on this thing. Also, apparently, I left my lantern over here, so bloody good thing I came back. Okay, here's the deal, though. Melbatross does love going after masts. We might lose it. And I don't really want to lose this thing. Um, hmm. Ooh, that might be a pretty good spot. Okay. Nope. Unless I can't put it there. Come on. There we go. Lovely, everyone. <laughs> there it is. I've had this thing for how long? Yeah, but look at that. 65 guaranteed damage. Oh, it's going to be lovely when we go after this thing later. Well, that is if we get it to actually spawn, because it's not like we got a guaranteed chance, folks, by fishing. No, 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 no. I think it's only a 10% chance when you snag one of those things. That's not great. But, folks, I'm on my way to the swamp. Why? Well, gotta make some water balloons. This also presents a way for me to show you guys just how bloody good bone armor can get. Yes, indeed. Okay, I need... Okay, that was a... That was a failure. I need at least one of you. you Want to come over here? Fine, fine, fine. So what's so good about bone armor, everyone? Well, let me just get one of these guys so I don't bloody ruin it. So, so, so. Put the thing on, right? He's going to try to hit me. He bloody can't. You block 100% of physical damage. But you can't do it back to back to back, as you can see. There is a cooldown. But it's a very fast cooldown, mind you. You can block 100% of damage for... As long as you want, as long as you have Nightmare Fuel, folks. Nightmare Fuel is what refuels Bone Armor. Uh, so, I mean, if you took down the Fuel Weaver, chances are you're in late game and you have a lot of it. So, Bone Armor is kind of insane. <laughs> it's ridiculously good. Oh, I also love when the world does the work for me. Beautiful. So, what I'm just doing, folks, is just getting Mosquito Sacks, right? And then, I can fill them up at a pond, just like that. Now I just need one more, and then we can do some balloonomancy. Oh, and I didn't even think of this, but I'm gonna need these, aren't I? Yeah, if I want to make the blow darts, I need reeds. So my goodness, the swamp was kind of chosen by me on a whim, but it is bloody working out, folks. Holy mosquitoes, though. Okay, one of you's gotta drop what the frick I'm looking for, right? Here's the thing about mosquitoes. Let them aggro on you, and then uh, you can pretty much get the first hit in all the time. But... Okay, kind of done already. That's all I needed. But yeah, let them get the aggro, and then uh, you can just perma stun them just like that. So boom, bada bang. Lovely, lovely. Now I can use this to heal. And look at this, everyone. Pile of balloons time. Beautiful. And I see no reason not to bloody start with the speedy balloon. 
Now this thing is kind of nuts. In the video, I said it was like 25 to 30% speed boost. It actually starts out at 35. And then as it goes down, of course it gets, uh, uh, or deflates rather, then it gets slower. But yeah, you can just have a better walking cane <laughs> right off the bat of spawn. It's kind of nuts. And then once you're done with it, you can decorate base with even lovelier balloons, right? But speaking of, he also has some new designs. And watch, I'm not even gonna get them, aren't I? Nope, there's one. There's a hound one, beautiful. Nope, that's not a new one. Uh, there's a new one, a tentacle, lovely. And then there should be a butterfly. No, yes, maybe, nope, that's another hound. All right, I've literally gone insane trying to get a butterfly and I freaking couldn't. <laughs> There's also no limit on his balloons anymore. Also good, but this does lead me to this guy, folks. The Bone Helm. All right, I do have four sanity, right? Not anymore. So the Bone Helm is kind of like a nightmare amulet, right? Only the nightmares that spawn now are actually not gonna hit you. They are not non-hostile, but they're kind of just a little timid. You see, they come try to hit you, and then they kind of back away like that. This could be a great way to farm Nightmare Fuel. The problem is, if I were to hit one of these, they'd all turn on me. So the Bone Helm is kind of for others. You put it on, have the others farm the Nightmares for you sort of deal. What it's also good for? The Lunar Island. Because as we know, the lower your sanity, the lower your enlightenment. So you won't have that blue filter, the Gestalt won't hurt you, blah blah blah. And also, the Lunar Grotto. We know that now too. But yeah. Now I have a big problem, because I just did that. <laughs> All for the sake of content, everyone. All for the sake of content. Oh, it's also technically armor, too, but you really shouldn't use it as armor. No, no, no. It's more of a strategic use thing. Like right now. Like I said, I have bloody no sanity right now, and these guys are giving me grief. So I just gotta get these guys off of me. Yes, yes, yes. And then do this, and then do that, and then do this. It's gonna hurt. Oh boy. Run, run, run. All right, back up to snuff, folks, with still two days left until winter. <laughs> Here I am just trying to pass time still. All right, what else we got? Hmm, speaking of sanity, I suppose, this stuff. The problem with the party balloon is when you attack it, it does hurt you, but at least you get some sanity back. It is actually a sanity overtime thing. It does not last long. In fact, it should be going away pretty much right now. Yup. But it is sanity overtime for the team. That's pretty darn good. The balloon hat here is kind of interesting. It has some wetness protection, but it does protect from lightning strikes. 100%. The problem is, when you're wearing balloon armor type things, and then they deflate all the way to zero, they pop, they deal damage, which is bad, not great. The best thing about his update maybe though, might be this, I love the inflatable vest, I really do. This thing is great. When you go down on a boat, it protects you from losing max health when you drown. That's kind of nuts, <laughs> it's so nuts, and it costs nothing. Practically, you can save your entire team the trouble of maybe drowning and losing max health just with some quick crafts like that. Bloody beautiful. And folks, that's probably all I can show you for the time being. Because if I want to go into the Shadow Thurple and the Fossil Fragments, I bloody need the actual thing to reanimate a skeleton, which is another Black Heart. Which means I gotta kill the Shadow Pieces again. Which is not happening anytime soon. So that will likely be one of the last things that we do in this playthrough. Because, yes, folks, I think it's probably time to say that West Wednesday here is very close to coming to an end. So I was going to come back and say it's no more dilly-dallying time. It's winter. It's boomerang. Snowbird. Death time. Right? But no, it's a full moon. And I need to go to my pig farm. And, uh, oh, I don't have any inventory for this yet. Um, hmm, you know what? Fine, I'll just leave stuff over there, I suppose. Oh no, everyone, I just made a realization over here by our pig farm. I did get a pig belt, that's great, but that's not my realization. Um, my realization is that I can't do my bird farming how I want to do it. Because I'm freaking Wes. <laughs> oh no, I don't deal enough damage to kill the birds in one shot with my boomerang. I, I forgot about it. I, I, I kind of forgot, like, this whole series. I'm Wes. The whole thing is that I don't deal 
enough damage. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, so, okay, hold up, hold up. Well, look, 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 look. Perfect example. This is what I was going to do. I was just going to constantly be doing that, right? Yeah, yeah. Um, I, ca I can't anymore. So, okay. I need to change up the strategy 40 minutes in here. All right. Plans changing on the fly. Doesn't always happen, folks, but you know what? Sometimes it just works out. <laughs> It's going to be fun, at least. It's going to be fun to do it this way, at least. I got the time, right? I got the time. I ain't doing nothing else. I'll just be standing over here doing exactly this. Farming freaking Azor feathers. And not even that many, too. Oh, son of a gun. I also just came to the realization that that was a full moon. But the problem is, I'm not sure if it was long enough for them to reach their final stage and then grow come a full moon probably not because those things take a while sometimes oh no oh no <laughs> oh no i might have severely severely mistimed things everyone today might be another preparation day <laughs> but you know what that means that could mean that next week next week could be the final week of west wednesday we take out the Malbatross and the Crab King in one day. I don't know. Depends on how fast I can get these Azor feathers. And look who's come to town, everyone. Yep, this was another reason for doing this, actually. This was n another reason for doing this. Hello, crappy boys. Yeah, I want uh, I want you guys to actually come over here and do stuff. Yep, 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 yep. That's what I wanted. Boom, 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 boom. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Yep, come get your other stuff. Come get your other stuff, friends. Your friend's stuff. Maybe this will finally be the playthrough that we get something, folks. Doubt it. Doubt it. Oh, come on. Really? Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, they actually steal traps, by the way. They steal traps. That's why I was standing over here. Come on, dude. Where are you going? Where are you going? What do you want to pick up? What do you want to pick up? Why are you not going after the Twix? There we go. There we go. There we go. Boom, 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 boom. Did it? Nope. No drop. <laughs> okay. Well, we might get a bonus, everyone. Oh, hello, round number two. Oh, four spawn? Uh-oh. That, that might mean they might have went somewhere else. Maybe in base, actually. <laughs> that would actually would have been really bad. Okay, I'm also completely blowing this Krampus spawn right now. <laughs> completely blowing it. They are getting away with some free stuff right now, let me tell you. Oh, perhaps third time's the charm, everyone. No bloody idea. Remember all of our playthroughs, how I always said I always wanted to get a Krampus sack and I never bloody have? <laughs> maybe, just maybe, this will be the one. Oh, okay. I didn't even bloody hear you that time, but come on, Krampus. This might be like literally one of the last times we see you in this playthrough. <laughs> you can do it. You can help us. Oh, wow, you're already almost dead because you ran through all those things. My bloody goodness. Nope, 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 nope. You took my balloon vest, though. Sure, why not? I'll tell you what, though. That was our last feather, everyone. 40 of the suckers. Hmm. Okay, I got time here. You know, it's not quite an hour and a half of recording. Who knows what is or isn't in the video. It's entirely possible that we could go over there and spawn this bird in. Hmm, I don't know. Let's try. Oh, but I do like the sight of that, everyone. That does mean that the next full moon, they're going to be ready. All right, come on, game. Don't fail me now. All right, there's one. Didn't get her. Okay, <laughs> keep it going. Come on, come on. Bad time, Wavy. Bad flipping time, dude. Oh, I'm surrounded by sea stacks right now. If this dude tries to mess with us, it's gonna be a problem. Please don't spawn in a really bad spot. Please don't spawn in a really bad spot. Nope, okay, that's good. One more. Again, to get rid of Wavy Jones, everyone just run up to his face three times. Then he'll just despawn for the entire night. He won't even bother you. All right, still trying to catch another fish, though. Not necessarily going very well. All right, you joined me almost a full day later. I literally went home, made a bloody stupid tackle box thing so I can make a new tackle box so that I can catch these things better. <laughs> okay, I got myself the spoons, everyone. All right, they're not even that great either. They give me barely a modifier in catching these things, but anything is gonna help at this point. Bloody anything. <gasps> As I freaking say that, oh my gosh, it was worth it. It was worth it, everyone. She's freaking here. She's freaking here. Oh, oh, I'm surprised she actually didn't go after my thing right there. Okay, all right. Um, 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 she's here. Yeah, it was worth it. Uh, uh it was worth it, everyone. <laughs> okay, in the morning, when you guys can actually see, let's get this thing done. 
Never mind, she's right on top of the boat right freaking now, everyone. Okay, it begins, it begins, it begins, it begins, it begins. I should be kiting right now, but I'm not kiting right now. Okay, 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 okay. We're gonna be fine, we're gonna be fine. No need to panic, no need to panic. We'll get it done, we'll get it done. Oh, she's going after that now? Beautiful, 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 beautiful. Oh, I just forgot that I don't even have this equipped right now. Great, I'm a genius. Uh, okay, then do this, then do this. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Gosh, that 75 health is a blessing and a curse at the same time. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Okay, all right, uh, okay, good, 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 save one, save one, now starts the kiting, everyone, now starts the kiting, nope, here she comes with that, all right, that's fine, she actually missed somehow, she actually bloody missed our mass, all right, come here, come here, come here, time for kiting, time for kiting, that's, oh, wow, she has a longer, oh, she's on top of the boat, that's right, okay, never mind, going for it, <laughs> just going for it, everyone, all right, all right, she's dead, she's dead, that was actually, both smooth and not smooth at the same time. <laughs> Melvatross, freaking dead. Oh my gosh. Okay, Nightfly Spooner for the win, everyone. Literally saved, whoops, literally saved our life today. Gosh, I didn't even use all of our blow darts that time. Didn't really have to. This thing came in handy. My gosh, this thing actually worked way better than I thought it was going to do. Okay, so the winged sail. Beautiful. The water fowl cam. Not really going to be doing anything for me. But this too. Boom, boom, boom. Lovely, lovely. Oh, cost silk. Forgot about that. Okay, everyone. Time to go home. <laughs> I'm actually kind of just flabbergasted. Oh, we got another one of these after I used it all up last week. I'm kind of flabbergasted right now. I was not anticipating getting her today what am i even going to be able to show off with the melbatross thing right now i don't know if i'll be able to show it off per se but i can at least show you guys so got the feather canvassing if i made a crap ton of those right i'd be able to come over here to make the winged sail kit everyone right i can't even do that probably take six i would be oh perfect actually it would be exactly the amount i need to make a least one winged sail kit which is one of the best uh mass in the game of course that's that's pretty much it because the waterfowl can is just uh wait a minute oh it's tools right um waterfowl can it even cost the malvatross bill which is nuts it just is more efficient than this guy pretty much but i mean they're both unlimited so I don't really see the point. Is a point to doing this though, everyone. The Melbatross figure. Beautiful. Lovely, lovely, lovely. I seriously am just rushing at this point. I really am. But look at that. That looks great. But there is one final boss to do, everyone. Day, what is it? 391? Day 391 is the day, everyone. When these seaweeds grow, we just got to capture a couple bees. Place them down and, well, sit around. <laughs> Gonna be a very anticlimactic end to the final boss. But that's it, everyone. That's it. We accomplished our goal today, and I really didn't think we were going to. But we took down the big bad blue bird. Good stuff. I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.